Vinyasa yoga is known today as a fast-paced dynamic yoga practice. And there is a deeper meaning to it. When we look at the Sanskrit word vinyasa, vinyasa, it literally means linking of the breath with the movement. Our breath is connecting with the flow of movement continuously. This is called vinyasa. And so it's important to be in the flow. And how to be in the flow and hear the breath is the key. Patabi Joyce, the founder of Ashtanga Vinyasa Yoga, he's also known as Guruji, he used to say that our practice is like a yoga mala. And I have a yoga mala today here. And not in the Hatha yoga practice, more of the, in the Bhakti yoga practice or in Mantra yoga practice, we often use this tool called Mala. Mala means prayer bead or the garland. It's usually made up with a certain numbers of the bead to count the prayer to the divine. And each bead are strung together with one single string from the beginning. There is a knot in each, between each breath and come all the way. And so it's one string. If the mala breaks, then you have to make it again from zero. So this is mala. So Patabi Joyce used to say that our vinyasa practice is exactly like this yoga mala. As we start, from the first asana, we connect into the second asana. And each postures are connected together with one string, one continuous flow of the breath awareness. And just like a prayer bead, just like a mala, every asana is an offering to the higher self, offering to the divine. With this attitude, with this heartful understanding, we have a potential to make our practice more sacred, make our practice more spiritual, rather than just doing a fast-paced, vigorous, sweaty, dynamic practice. That is absolutely wonderful. But at the same time, we are remembering in the depth of our heart that each asana is a prayer. And then there is always an awareness of the breath during, in between, and as a background. Just like this invisible string inside of the bees in the mala, it's not that obvious as the asana itself. Yeah, it is constantly there as the invisible string. So may we remember the breath throughout our vinyasa practice. And this is the essence of what makes vinyasa yoga practice, connecting with the breath and the movement in the flow. 99% practice, 1% theory. See you on the yoga mat for practice.